Tyler Rill, followed by Stutzman from Bloomsburg to here. Let's talk about that, man. You know, uh, you were at Bloom for a year. You're Maryland state champion from Maryland. But uh, you come a little bit further away from Maryland. This isn't closer. Uh, why follow John Stutzman? Um, I mean, I was with him last year for a whole year at Bloomsburg, and he's just very passionate about the whole sport of wrestling. He cares about all of his, all the guys on the team. Um, I mean, he's a great coach, not only on the mat, off the mat. Um, and I don't know, I love the guy. So I decided when he got the job here, I have four more years of eligibility, so I'd come with him. What's the goal, obviously, going into, you know, having four years, you want to be a starter, you want to make the NCAA tournament. You know, what's the goal? What's ultimately the goal? You know, you're 12 and 10 last year, I believe, was your record yeah. at Bloom. What's the goal this year, and what's a realistic goal? I mean, All-American. I got to get there, uh, keep working my way through each match each year, and then we have the max, and then when we get to the NCAA tournament, become an All-American. That's my goal for this year and um, in the future, national champ. Uh, I asked Angelo about the, the rankings. Wasn't a whole lot of respect for the Buffalo Bulls and the rankings, the MAC rankings. What do you think of that? I mean, I, I don't really like to look at rankings too much. I think this year, once we get on the mat, uh, once everything gets going, we'll definitely prove ourselves a lot better than what we are right now. Um, I mean, you can't really judge rankings at the beginning of the season. It's all how you finish out at the end. And uh, I think once we get started, we'll be good to go. Anything you're going to miss about Bloomsburg University? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I love the whole, I love the team there. Uh, I mean, Veltri, Sh uh, Sam Shirey, Kevin Hartnick, Matt Rappo, all those guys. Uh, I mean, they were good. They were good guys. Uh, I, it was hard for me to choose, but I mean, I got to go with Stutzman. He's helped me out through this whole year. Uh, he got me to commit to Bloom, and now he got me to come here, and uh, I, I couldn't be happier. Uh, knowing, knowing the team they're going to have this year, they're going to challenge for an EWL title. I think they're pretty tough. Is it hard leaving a team and pressing the reset button, coming to a place you haven't been to, and, and not knowing what you're going to get? Well, you know what you're going to get with Stutzman, but not knowing what you're getting with a new team, was that, was that a hard decision? Yeah, it, it definitely was. Um, but, I mean, I, I trust Stutzman, and I know that he'll, it might take a little bit, but we'll get this program turned around and back on top soon enough. When you look at the wrestling from Maryland, you went to PA. How much different did the wrestling, and I know it wasn't high school wrestling, but just seeing you wrestle with a lot of Pennsylvania kids, now you're going to wrestle with a lot of New York kids. You've seen a lot of culture of wrestling. You know, it's East Coast wrestling, but how much has, did it change from Maryland to PA wrestling kids to now New York kids? How much did that change? Well, I mean, Maryland, we're not really known as a big wrestling state. But we're definitely getting tougher. Um, and then, I mean, those Pennsylvania kids, man, they're just balls to the wall, tough kids. And uh, New York, I mean, they're tough. They're tough kids too. It's a little bit different than where I came from, from Maryland. But luckily enough, in my high school, uh, I wrestled with a bunch of like out-of-state kids because we traveled a lot as a team. So I've got to see some of it. But um, I think the biggest thing for me was coming from high school to college, that transition and getting used to just the different wrestling styles and stuff like that. Favorite thing about Buffalo? Uh, I mean, I, I love I love the team. I hang out with the team all the time. Um, we're all really close, starting to get close. We got, I think it was like 16 or 17 new guys come come in this year. And uh, I think we're all starting to become good friends. All right, Tyler, thanks for the time. You got anything else for me? That's it. Go Bulls. Go Bulls. <laughs>